Let's just call it for what it is. An all-out brawl. This match is not an impressive display of holds. This is a war. A war where two men are going to attempt to tear each other limb from limb and pulverize one another beyond recognition. And King, we have a front row seat. Oh, and he got dropped. Oh, they couldn't find a home for that one. Well, it certainly wasn't due to a lack of trying, Michael. As we watch Baron Corbin, let's get your take on him. Here's somebody who's willing to do just about anything to get to the top. I like it. That's the way it should be. Quick thinking to avoid that. Slams down with a big leg drop. Oh, man, that's almost all oh, your weight falling on him. Uh-oh. The good sleeper hold. Tough move to get out of. Not today. Too fast. He's trying to mangle his face here. Oh, nobody home that time. What's going to happen now? Quick thinking to avoid that. And it's apparent that Baron Corbin has been injured. We're looking at complete domination here. He needs to dig way down deep if he wants to keep going now. Going for it all here. And there's the submission hold. Will this do it? He's wearing him down with a very effective submission hold. I don't believe the destruction we're seeing. This guy's just going from one painful move to another. I bet they could hear that one up in the row. She wrote. Incredible. This has to be it. We know what's coming here. He may have to tap out right here. This is such a painful hold. And he lets him out. Well, he might have been losing some of his grip there anyway. That wild strike found nothing but empty air that time. <laughs> Man, that's what you call swinging for the fences and missing. He's displaying classic offense here. Yeah, and that's when he's the most dangerous. What a ruthless act. That is not a position you want to be in at any point in this match or ever. Quick thinking to avoid that. And this has got to be it. They got him. Two, three. What a win. Man, he's got to feel great. Here's your winner, Big Money! Perfect execution of that win, I'd say.